Paul, do you think your uh, scoring for you could be a little bit easier this year just with all the other options on the floor, like at all times? You don't have to make contested shots, have to do as much one-on-one -on -one maybe? I don't know. Uh, you know, I think we got a lot of weapons, you know, so, uh, you know, whether it's my scoring or my passing, you know, I think game in and game out and all this kind of pretty much, like I said, like I said before, is going to just try to get a feel with what I need to get a game. So, uh, you know, but hopefully with the weapons we got, uh, it'll open up the floor a lot more, you know, especially with Jason, you know, uh, Jeff Green, you know, those guys, and especially with the small lineups, we're going to have a lot of small lineups at times. It's really going to open up the floor and give us a lot of space. Well, I want to stay injury free. Uh, I want to be consistent in everything I do. And ultimately, uh, try to win another championship. You know, that's pretty much the goal. I really don't have any individual goals uh, outside of just staying healthy. Uh, but as far as uh, uh, earning something, it's going to be a championship. You know, that's all. That's my goal. You know, that's my career. How do you keep yourself motivated you know, when you've got all the individual accolades you've won the title, you've been a finals MVP? What's the motivation that keeps you getting up at this? I, I really love the game. I mean, you know, at the end of the day, you know, I've been playing the game more than half my life. Uh, and just period. I, I just love to be out here. I love the competitiveness. I love the team camaraderie. Uh, it's something I wake up and, and look forward to each and every day. And uh, I don't know, you know, I don't have that anymore. You know, what, what's going to be next? I haven't really thought about it, but you know, that, that part of me is something that I just love every morning to wake up to know that I'm going to be around my teammates. I'm going to practice. I'm going to enjoy the camaraderie, the spirit, the teamwork, uh, you know, everything that comes with being a basketball player. And it just seems that players throughout the league are able to play more and more. Look at you, Kevin, Steve Nash. You can go down the line. Guys who are still productive you know, after many years in the game. I think you got to have it in you. I think it's have to, you have to have a certain competitiveness in you to, to wonder. A lot of guys who have been so talented throughout the years are falling off, and I think they probably lose love for the game as they get older, as their talent diminishes. Uh, you really got to love the sport uh, to be there for a long time. You know, you got to... Uh, get the work in in the summer. Uh, I mean, it's just here. You gotta, it has to be in. You know, and you see the guys that it's not in them. Uh, you know, they don't do the things that they did that, that made them uh, the best players. And, you know, they stop doing those things. And do you change things up much at all, Paul, as you get older to just keep that edge, to keep sharp, to be on top of your game? Well, you change up things here and there based on your age uh, and what you're capable of. I think. You know, I'll probably take more more days off to rest my body, uh, save some of the miles in the summer, but I do enough to be ready for training camp to, to be prepared for the season. Uh, and I know what I, I know what I need to do to be ready, and, and that's that's the key.